Hey guys, welcome to Johnson Party of Six. In today's video, we are going to do a movie review. We went to see Frozen 2. So stay tuned to see what we thought of the movie and to spice it up a little bit, we are going to have a freeze dance challenge. Hey everybody, welcome to Johnson Party of Six. We are headed to go see an M-O-B-I-E movie. See, does anybody want to take a guess? Beetlejuice. Yeah, me. me. Uh, Henry. The new Star Wars. No. Nope, not the new Star Wars. Charlotte, what are we going to go see? The new Toy Story? Nope. We're going to go see Frozen 2. Yeah! We are going to give our review of Frozen 2. No. And okay. hopefully, hopefully Dad can get through this. How do you top Frozen 1? The first Frozen was... Epic. Epic. So good. Let it go. Let it go. Can't hold it back anymore. We forgot the most important element. Popcorn. Popcorn. Daddy. Can you hey, we Okay, we got the most important I items. Popcorn and a drink. Where do you fill the drink? Drinks are right over there. Charlie, you passed it. Charlotte. Charlotte. Dad, I don't know how to how I feel it. Daddy, you have to help me so it will overflow. Tell me what you're doing. Make sure it doesn't overflow. Almost. Almost. Okay, stop right there. Stop. Okay. Now go put it on the counter. Yep, take a sip, make sure it's good, and then put the lid on. Okay. Oh, man. Wow. All right, here we go. Ooh. Get a straw. No. Straw right down there. Okay, there we go. Yeah, make sure you get the excellent form. Go. Hurry, hurry, hurry. All right, so we just finished the movie, movie. Frozen 2. Let's see here. On a scale of one to ten, with ten being you loved it and one was now nah, was open. Nah. Can you do between? What would them? you say? Let's start with the kids. Seven. Camden, you give it a seven? I thought it would be better, but it was like the same thing all and over again. It's McKay, what do you think? Probably an eight or nine and a half. It was not what I expected. Okay, Henry, what did you give it? Ten. And why? Actually, at five or ten. So there were a couple of things that I thought about the movie. It was okay. Everybody thought that Olaf was really hilarious. That was the only time that I heard people laughing was when Olaf would do something really funny. But it was kind of distracting watching the movie. There were so many kids in there walking around. Did you notice that? There were like parents walking around and kids walking around. Well, the movie did just come out. So the you know, like the week or whatever that it first comes out, there's going to be a lot of people in the theater like a lot of kids so that was kind of distracting but i would give the movie a six or a I was seven gonna, I, was I liked most of the music but it was like a lot of it was pretty deep like the storyline was kind of heavy and i thought i'm an adult trying to follow this along i wonder how a kid could follow along did you guys follow along the story okay yeah yeah yeah, yeah. There's so much on that popcorn, loving it. Um, I I like the music. I'll listen to the soundtrack for sure. But I wasn't like, oh my gosh, that was so good. Like the first movie, I just loved so much. The movie was that. Oh really? Oh, I love Frozen. Why I don't know, but I, way I'm always more of a critic than someone that loves it. If I thought the original Frozen was much better and this one like mom said was very deep the animation was amazing the yes Elsa on her water horse 
that that was beautiful like the main it, that was really cool the first frozen is playing in our tv back here and we just went in you're watching it in the car yeah it's right here it seems like i always like movies a little bit better the second time and now that i've had a few days to mull it over I think I like Frozen 2 a little bit better than I originally said. So here's my updated review. All right, so now the kids are back from school. So we are going to give you our updated review on Frozen 2. But still give it maybe like a seven. This is a spoiler. I've So if you don't wanna hear it, you're gonna have to fast forward or something. But the voice calling to Elsa, I've just been thinking about that so much and it was her mom. Um, and that is so sweet. I love that because in Frozen, the first Frozen, you feel like they are like these detached parents and then they die. And Oh, and Olaf's review oh. of Frozen 1. Wasn't that oh, funny? Yeah. Yes. Oh, yes. Yes. Did you guys? Uh, anyway, we've all been singing. What have we been singing? Oh. Oh. <laughs> we love that. Yeah. Ooh, sing it into the unknown. But any other updates? Just in the first one, like when he like sings like the summer song mm -hmm. and then when it goes to summer and he's like melting. I love summer. <laughs> I know, isn't that cute? Now we are going to play Phrase Dance! You're gonna win? Yeah, These are the rules for the game. You dance like there is no tomorrow. And then when the music stops, what do you have to do? Freeze. freeze! The last person to move, they're out of there. Can you blink and breathe? You can breathe, but you can't blink. What? Like the best dance moves. You have to go <laughs> fast. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Who was it? Sam, you gotta move fast. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Camden! I was walking. I know, you're out. All right, Mac and Hank, together. <laughs> oh, I think that was a tie. <laughs> got the splits down. You're the little dancer. No! <laughs> you totally did! Oh, sorry. Okay. You ready? Camden, Lexi says hi. Oh, hi, Lexi. We want to give a shout out to Justin, Lexi, and Becca. Thanks for watching, guys. Hey, Joel, this is a shout out. Thanks for watching.
for watching our videos and tell your friends to subscribe. And if you have any comments, you can head on over to our Instagram and leave something there. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our channel. Bye, see ya. See ya.